viewers across the world, uh, this is your host Chico Squared once again, and this is a continuation from our previous video. In our previous video, we were looking at the Zimbabwe Schools Examinations Council November 2022 question paper for question one. So this is question number two. In question number two, we are required to factorize the following algebraic expression. How do we factorize this algebraic expression, right? First and foremost, the word factorize comes from the word factor. And a factor is a number which gets into another number without leaving a remainder. So when we are to factorize this algebraic expression, first and foremost, let's look for the common factors. The number which gets into a year and there without leaving a remainder, right? So, as you can see, the common factor that we have here is m minus n. Because we have m minus n this side, and we have two m minus n's this side. So, the, the, the common factor is m minus n. So, I'm going to factor out m minus n, right? And then m minus n getting into m minus n, they cancel out, they go for a honeymoon, and then we are left with 4m plus 2n. Right, minus. Then m minus n, this side getting into m minus n squared, right? It's a situation like this. m minus n squared is like this, right? And then m minus n is getting into that. So these, again, they are going to go for a honeymoon in Honolulu, Hawaii, and then we are left with the M minus N that side. So this is minus M minus N. We close the brackets. But we are not yet done. We need to simplify whatever is in this square bracket. So this is what we're going to do. Right, m minus n we do a rap up boy. I don't want to make a stick it as a so I'm gonna write a pap. Right, tap to dilla my energy. Next room card to miss bracket is guru it at it. So this is 4m plus 2n. Then we're we'll gonna negative sign. You're gonna send around a bracket. You know, change some sign as soon as there's a room card, then bracket right over rap. So this is minus m plus n. Close. M minus N. And then in this bracket, it's my like terms. I know when I I know when I would add, I know subtract. 4M minus M, we get it 3M. Then 2M plus N, we get 3N. But still, we are not yet done with the question. Why? Because Okay, bracket a common factor three, and it. So what you all are supposed to do here, right? You are going to factor out three from this bracket, and then three into three m you get m, three into three n you get n. Close, and then we have m minus n that side. Wagarari poya. Right. This is our final answer. And for all the effort that we have put into this question, Zimsek is rewarding us with two marks. All right. Let's move on to the next question, the B part. This is the A part. Let's move on to the B part of the question. So allow me just to erase this question here. Right, so that I create more space for the next question. And I hope you are being enlightened with whatever we are doing here. Just as a reminder, can also now like, also now subscribe, but to many on the one of the icon, each or two, so manje, manje, and it right to be here is a question now. You can check on the screens was question in Rubraf to Pap. The average mass, the average mass of 11 players is 81 degrees. When one player is removed, the average mass becomes 80.1 kilograms. Calculate the mass of the removed player. Kwa ipanewa 11, 
Hundred. Don't come play as a bora cricket guy. Nechi at so nechi. Hundred. As far as the level is, is one of the ring a bora. Hundred. Right. Pani wan eleven varipo. Pani wan eleven varipa. Shurugun zizo average mass ya wo i eighty one kgs. You know the average. Tom bota misa wan eleven na but rocha ka average mass ya wo ino chakwa se. Tino eight ama masses awo se vari eleven. Then tu ata divide the number ya wo vari eleven. Kudar nuka tuzo wana nandet. Right. So tu kuzo wana average ya wo na wo eighty one kgs. Hundred. Pa ba viswa muno an. Pa viswa muno an. Average ya wo wari ten. Yo be ita eighty koma one kgs. Saka a viswa watch anga ne masiechi. Was very important that you comprehend the question. Yes, of course. Uyu mutauro wamambo chalo pa ingrand, right? Waka wya lingara wangu katyo kira mukung. So try by all means possible, especially if you encounter questions that involve word problems. Unyasons we see sa kudvaru fuzo du di and it usa twenda kuno attempt a question yacho yo. Right. So panel bagaj down so va question yant let to put it let. The total mass for the eleven players be equal to let's say T. We don't go to any letter of the alphabet or would and it. We've made it T and it. So as you know, those are good. We got total total. We actually know T. What do I divide by nine? Na eleven. You know, for now, Cuba. Average ya wata wala poktanga inova ndiani 81. Right? So tabu chitaka manji oti t ndiani so we are solving this simple linear equation. We remove the fraction by multiplying both sides by 11. By 11 uko. Then these ones cancel out. Then you are going to get it t being equal to 81 multiplied by 11. And it. So 81 multiplied by 11, let's just do a quick uh, arithmetic on that one. Zero here, one, eight, one, eight, one, nine, then eight, that side. So 891. So the total mass for the 11 players is 891 kilograms. Now, let's go on to the next part of the question, right? Pa 891 kg is 11 is. Pa ne mumaka viswa e pap. Then average yavo vari 10 by asara iri chi. Iri, ya by asara iri 80,1. Satura masi ya mumaka viswa wa achu. Right. Let the mass of the removed player. Right, let's call it equal to M. And it. So, I can tell you guys that I'm a statement ray question. You want to manage. Statement ray question. You want to guys that I'm going to. Pa 891. Very 11. Minus. We are the M. We are Biswa. And it. Divided by ten and it. expression in words are average one wasara very poor ten and it. And this is equal to Tao's average yao very ten one wasara. Tao's one's average yao very ten one wasara and yan eighty comma one kilograms. So again, we are now solving this simple linear equation for M. So what we are going to do first and foremost, we are going to multiply, we are going to remove uh, the fractions and it. So we multiply na 10 from both sides. Ugo times na 10, ugo times na 10, and it. It's what I say, zoves rana, zo cheka night. Kosa rwa chi, kosa rwa. 891 minus M is equal to then 80.1 multiplied by 10, you are going to get 801. So solving for M, we will not jump away and say, we are also going to have a video on equations. Right? 
So M here, so this jumps the equal sign, and then when it crosses the equal sign, if it's a positive, it metamorphoses into a negative sign, all right? So we are going to have minus M from the left-hand side is going to be equal to 891 minus 801, 891 minus 801, right? Zero up, nine up, and it. So it's going to be equal to minus 90. Then you divide both sides by minus one. So M is going to be equal to 90 kilograms. So ladies and gentlemen, mass in 90 kilograms, and it. I'm now proceeding to the last question uh, 2C, right? And question number 2C, uh, right, let me just uh, first of all start by erasing uh, the question number 2B at Tinaeva Bodaba. Now, we have some bit of hydrogen oxide, and it's H2O per chemistry. Right, because it's water language chemistry, right? right. Anyway, hands in a 2C. Maria uses 40% of her pocket money to buy shoes, and it. Papa, she uses 30% of the remainder to buy a dictionary. Find the percentage of her pocket money that is left, and it. First, through what is this, Maria? And a hundred percent, and it. So, so, I'm 100% without a problem. I got chance of 40%. Yeah, Maria and I, and it. So, I just assume out at Angar by 100, but I shan't score 40. Sakapan of a Pasarachi, sickest. Sakapan 100 is a visa 40, Posara sickest, and it. Poor Pans over a chance of 30%. Yes, a Sara. I got chance of 30%. Right. Yan. Ya sikiste wa saraf diye. Right, let's calculate cha cha. Six times thirty, hundred eighty. Hundred eighty divided by ten, we get eighteen. And it. Pasikiste and ya sara. Aga bashansa eighteen. Sagasa ruanengan. So this is just going to be sixty minus eighteen. So sixty minus eighteen. Zero minus eight can't. It is one right there, two up, four up, 42%. So Maria is left with 42% of what she had from the beginning. We are now moving on to 2D, question number 2D, which carries four marks. So question number 2D, we have four minus X divided by X is going to be equal to x over 2, and it? Right. This is, we, we are su supposed to solve this equation. So first and foremost, it's going to be cross-multiplication, and it? Whereby 2 is going to multiply 4 minus x, and this is equal to x multiplied by x over at per x squared, and it? So t x panda bracket panda, but we're going to have 8 minus 2x is going to be equal to x squared. As you can see, turn expression na x squared. So, so turn expression na x squared. You know that this is now a quadratic equation, and it. So the actions of my principles are quadratic, and it. So my quadratic equation is before you solve any quadratic equation, first of all, make sure the quadratic equation is equated to zero, and it. So and the other Number zero says zero jamba equal sign zero x squared zero. And remember, number ninety jamba equal sign no be achieve sign ya. Yangere plus zero minus yangere minus zero plus. So we are going to have x squared. Uyo jamba oyo over zero plus two x. Uyo jamba oyo minus eight is equal to zero. And then now go change your name. So we are going to show you how to go. And zero and there are zero. 
Sumosukaenda wako. Ndako chicha nsa. Sa suru kumfa shawe wako. Sa tanga unyuru wapana hapa. Zero anga sara wako. Mba azo unyuru wako nchetu. Kuti sati. Sa wako tukonfusa. But otherwise. So ongo resu nsa mechete. So. This is now a quadratic equation. And we are supposed to solve this quadratic equation. And. Ma quadratic equation. I'm going to solve whatever methods are not here. One. You can solve a quadratic equation by. Using factorization method. Can a factorization method. Is not shandy. Uno shansa nsa the quadratic formula. X is equals to minus B plus minus the root of B squared minus 4AC over 2A. Or we can use, you know, the completing the square. But, uh, so th there, there are many ways to kill a cat in mathematics, and it? However, you have to choose the easiest way to kill that cat. Kudusa peza ngua. Sakapanap, the easiest method you are talking about, shan sabap, is the factorization method, and it? So in the factorization method, what we are going to do, Tia times are minus 8, ni coefficient ya x squared, which is 1. And then we get minus 8. Tu adachaka namba mbiri, zi kutika zi eda, kana uzi minus, zi notipa plus 2. Tika zi times, zi notipa minus 8. So we're going to start with 8 by 1. 8 by 1, na haite. 4 by 2, 4 by 2, na haita. Partition that plus 4 and minus 2. Once we got the plus 4 minus 2, unuona plus 2 araba hapa. We got plus 4 multiplied by minus 2. We know minus 8 are up. So normal factors are true. Da. So since pan the coefficient here 1, we can x squared. We can just open two brackets here. To set x up. To set x is up. Pang bach to set plus 4 wajo. Pang bach to set minus 2 wajo. Right. Tasar wana x plus 4 wajo times x minus 2 being equal to 0. In the mathematics, you can go on a number two or more. Zika times and it's simply just zero. So now the packet pay number is just zero. So when number zika times and it's zero hundred, ningi times ningi times ningi times ningi, you can go on equal to zero. So now the packet pay number zero says just just zero. Because in the end, you neutralize that this much plus zero. So the times and number bereads zika just zero. So now the packet pay number is zero two is just zero. So to put either x plus four. Dear zero, can I put x minus two? Dear zero. So the guys are good. X are equal to minus four. We are a jumbo in that side. Or plus two. We are a jumbo in that side. Because remember, my quadratic equations is alpha and beta two values of x. And for this effort, yes, you have to apply a question number two D. We are handsomely rewarded with four marks by the Zimbabwe Schools Examinations Council. Ladies and gentlemen, I hope you are comprehending and I hope this information is infiltrating your cerebral hemispheres without much difficulty, right? So this has been question two. So in the next video, we are going to be moving on to the third question. Takaenda, takaenda. I want to express my sincere gratitude to Farmer Media Productions, the crew behind the scenes, Post Kingston, ahoy. Thank you so much. So, be sure to like and subscribe to our YouTube channel so that you get notifications of our future videos. Ladies and gentlemen, this is your host, Chico Squared, the crew behind the scenes. Be blessed and stay blessed. I salute you.